Number 19, to consider final adoption of an ordinance authorizing the mayor on behalf of the city to enter into necessary contracts, including a contract and development agreement with Third Street Partners and New Horizons Development, providing for a sale of six acres, more or less, of property from the city and otherwise concerning a portion of property formerly being part of the Hodges Stockyard Track located on Third Street to set out and provide relative to terms and conditions in a cooperative endeavor and development agreement between the parties to authorize a contract to sell and a contract of sale of property for consideration from the city to the third parties for development and construction activities on the project site, including new construction of commercial improvements and other facilities and relative to third parties constructing an additional improvement, River Place Phase 2, providing for 64 additional rental units on a portion of the property to authorize certain funding from SPARC or the capital budget for assisting development and infrastructure costs to authorize a lease of a substation located on the subject property, authorizing incentives and public works related to the proposed cooperative endeavor and to authorize security instruments and authority for the mayor or his designee to subordinate security instruments if necessary pertaining thereto and otherwise to provide with respect thereto. This item came by committee in opposition. Uh, can we uh, have a motion to second and that reference uh, from uh, representative of the committee, which is Councilman Jonathan Goins district, and I also would like to have a roll call vote on this matter. I move it for discussion. Uh, let, let me ask this. Uh, the gentleman that's in, oh, I'm sorry, go ahead. You second it? No. You need a second? I need to discuss. We, let's have a motion second just to discuss. I'll second. We, we have a motion by who, who made the motion? He did. Goins. Motion by Councilman Goins, second by Councilman Fowler for discussion. Discussion, let's have it. Councilman Fowler. Uh, this item uh, had a lot of controversy both sides. Uh, <laughs> And it's a it's a tremendous uh, amount of money to to uh, pass up. The gentleman that uh, is heading up the project said if it does if he does not complete it in two weeks it goes away. He can't do it. Uh, I'd ask that we simply just delay it for two weeks. If for some reason someone has an epiphany or if there is a change of heart uh, for the project, if people that are far come back. Uh, and, and speak to it, that's fine. We call a special meeting, we may be able to do it. If nothing happens, it goes away anyway because the gentleman said if it's not done in two weeks, it's not done. So I'd ask that we consider that. Councilman Goins. Once again, as I uh, stated in the committee, uh, I support the project. I, I, I love the project. I think it will. Uh, do well uh, for the lower third community and the city of Alexandria. However, uh, the citizens that live there that I represent, uh, I'm their voice. I'm their voice up here. I, I make decisions uh, for them. I, I speak for the elderly women that can't come to council meetings and speak themselves. And, uh, it's apparent that the citizens that live in that area are opposed to it. Uh, so that's why I'm opposed to it. Anyone else? Yeah, I'd like to direct a question. With that, ha having said that, though, you're asking about, you know, ha have further discussion. Wouldn't that be counterproposal, uh, counterproductive, since for all practical purposes you indicated that perhaps those persons who are for it would not come here? Or you want a chance, taking a chance two weeks from now, asking more people to come to see if there's any change in voice? Or do you just want to vote weeks. on it? I think, uh, first, I, I didn't ask any questions. <laughs> The meeting was at 3.30. Uh, it was published. The citizens they, they came should, up. You should have been here. Okay. If I thought it was in myself, it would be different. Okay. But okay. Okay, I'm going to call for the question with a roll call vote. Madam Clerk. We the motion. motion Can I have a motion? Yeah, we need a motion and a second. Well, motion to discuss. I need a motion to I'm, I move that uh, we, we make a motion to uh, in opposition of it. Uh, do you have a second? In opposition of it. <coughs> do we understand? Am I right? I mean, do we need to, to do that? Oh, no, it's a vote off. Oh, it's a vote off. It's a vote off. It's a vote off. It's a vote off. Yes or no? Madam Clerk, roll call. A yes vote would be a vote in favor of passage. Right. And no vote would be in opposition. 
Right. So okay. is that Stain a motion by Mr. Warbordain and right. did you second it? No, no I didn't second it. Right. And Mr. Fowler discussed. second it. We were already discussing we need to go ahead and take the vote. Am I right? Now, yeah, now the motion is to consider adoption. Yeah. Which means if you if you're in favor of the motion to adopt it, you've got to vote yes. If you're against it, you vote no. Can we get a motion second? Let's let's move it. Moved okay. move by Councilman Goins, second by Councilman Lavadan. Roll call vote. Mr. Goins. No. Mr. Silver. Stain. Mr. Johnson. No. Mr. Larvadane. No. Mr. Fowler. Yes. Ms. Gibson. No. Mr. Villard. No. Mr. President, you have one yes, five no's, and one abstaining. Thank you, Madam Clerk. So it fails. Move to the next item on the agenda. Committees. Okay. I'd like to also recommend. Just one second. Point of order, please. Before we adjourn, I would like to recommend that we send a, a letter to the family of Howard Yist for the years that he served to the community and the outstanding work he performed. Okay, Madam Clerk. Uh, yes, sir. Okay, she, she has that information. Okay, let's go directly to committees and we'll wrap up.